with just one or two team fights. What's all him looking to build right now? Kailangan niya na ba mag-winter transition? Yun ba ang next focus? Mm, possible. Pero ang tingin ko, ang gusto niya kunin next, Holy Crystal eh. Tingin ko, kinukulang sila ng damage eh. Alright. I agree. I agree. Kasi nga itong dalawang to eh, si Vinja kasi R7 eh. So ML right now, wise. Less than half health. Tatalo na ni R7. Sasayaw-sayawan. And that's gonna be it! Mountain Shocker to the face. Magkadikit-dikit. Thirst, that's another way to break the Ube. Talagang sabayan mo head on, labanan mo. Paramdam ko may translator sila nung naisip nila yung isip ng Ube. Ganun yung nangyari. But still, Blacklist International, they can get back. RRQ, they are controlling this game. But as long as this is not the 12 minute Lord, it's still okay. Defendable. But we have to think ahead. Kung, let's say, Luminous to, umabot ay sa Luminous. At this point, mukhang kailangan natin umabot ng Luminous. Uh, Lacklist International, their, their wave clear, it's, it's, it's not the best. Mm, well, I do agree. But uh, still, you have to give it up to Blacklist International at kung paano nila gagawin dito yung kanilang mga teamfight. Because in terms of healing, lalo lalo na kay Oheb, mm -hmm. yung alalay ni Rafaela sa kanya, it doesn't work as good dahil nga meron sila dito isang back siya yeah. na pumipigil ng lahat ng yan. But uh, still, you have to remember, for the side of Blacklist International, it's all about one good play. Haji, hindi ka pa nakikita yung one good si Pa or si Edward, hindi pa nakukuha yung one good uppercut na hinahanap natin. Oo. Oh. Hirap yung uh, ating uh, MMA duo sa Interdisciplinary Olympics ng game number 2. And that can be Lord up top. Mabubutas ba ang blacklist? Dumidepend sila. All lanes being pushed in by RQ Hoshi. And it looks like that's going to be uh, a safe defense up top. Okay. So, no casualties and no inhibitors taken down. Kapit Pilipina 7.5. 4K gold lead ang meron ngayon ang side ng RRQ. But still, remember, kapag ka ganito na, pagka tumaganda talaga yung game ng Todo, dito sila makamakabawi pero hindi na ata aabot doon. Ang galing ng huli. That was a face check with a space set by RRQ. Walang kamalay-malay si VWise na mangyayari yun. And Blacklist International falling to the pressure pero ang importante naman is hindi matumba yung base. Mm -hmm. Edward, ako po! Yung passive nung Yi Sun Shin na gamit ni Albert doon. Napabagsak si Edward Balboa sa knockdown. Two defenders, now three defenders left. Venus back on the map now. Pero kompleto ang RRQ dito. Delix, Butters, Delix! You have to give it up to kay Sai kung paano niya kontrolin yung mga laban. And look at this kung paano sila tamaan ng Mountain Shocker. It's scary to the point na parang wala na silang sagot ngayon. Yup, RWM set in. Oh, hey, Mabe Basic. And the base is gonna go down as well. Game number two goes over to RQ Hoshi. Oh, napatayo na si Saiko. Oh, diba? Ayan, diba, ayan. Sabi ni sabi ni Saiko. Oh, ayan na, natanggal ko na yung jersey. Ay, yung ano, hoodie. Yun lang pala yung kulang. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Ladies and gentlemen, of course, we're gonna see a game number three. Well, these are the titans of MLBB's... Uh, Biggest countries, sabihin na lang natin, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. RQ Hoshi and Blacklist International. And given that nag-back siya na sila, nagamit na nila dito yung, uh, sabihin natin, yung EVE, what, merong pang time to adjust dito yung side ng Blacklist International. And 